Surprise, mother... <coughs> Microphone. Alvin, can you hear me? Yeah, baby. Yes, I can. And am I clear? And am I synced up? <laughs> yes, yes, we are all awesome. I'm oh, sorry, that was a response to what Elsa just put in the group chat. Dead man walking good. Welcome to the party. Welcome to the surprise party. <laughs> <laughs> so what are you guys doing? I didn't tell anybody I was going live. No one knows I'm here. Well, I mean, except you two. You're not synced up. Okay, well, that sucks. Okay. On my end, anyway. You're too late. I don't click this thing now. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay, it's on my end a couple times. Now you are. Awesome. Thank you, Caden. Okay, that's good shit. Okay, guys, am I blacking out on you? Okay. 
Oh my God, I feel like I'm starving all of a sudden. You're not synced up. up, damn the devil. Okay, I'm going to give it a minute. Video quality is very good, but at least you're synced up now. Wait, did you say my video quality isn't good? Huh. Hang on, let me unplug my camera. Excuse me. And then plug it back in. Son of a bitch. Why does it keep going out? Yes, I'm going to be a big baby and whine about it. Oh. One moment, please. Robert! Okay, my camera keeps going in and out, and I don't know why. Confession time. <laughs> Robert, however did you find me? <laughs> Couldn't hardly make you out at first, but your quality keeps coming and going. Yeah, my camera keeps going in and out. It'd be as good as it was last night. I know, right? Damn, and I've got two cameras. I could plug up the other one if I can find it. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, hang on, guys. You're going to lose me for a second. Well, video-wise, I don't know if you'll still be able to hear me.
Out of sync. Okay, hang on. I gotta, gotta check my mic because I just had to switch cameras. <clears throat> okay, now hopefully that straightened it out. Okay, guys, now how is it? Fine for you, okay. I don't know. Okay, well, now I'm just going to get pissed. I wonder. Huh. That's much better. Maybe it's your connection. Oh, that's true. It could be the connection. Okay. Your quality is better. Can you hear me? I know it was really good last night. Okay, guys, I'm frigging with the settings. Is why it's changing on you at this moment. Still not exactly in sync. Okay, hang on. Yes, we can hear the Japanese movie. <laughs> Okay, this, this is the microphone in the computer. Ow. It's actually starting to piss me off. I normally have really good quality. And welcome to the insanity. Japanese wild woman's live stream. That's right.
pissing me off too. But don't fret. Well, I said I'm not fretting. Because last night it was almost perfect. So is this any better? We need more midnight streams from you during the witching hour. Okay, well, I'm looking at it on YouTube on my phone, and I can't hear it because I've got it muted, uh, but the video quality looks good, but somebody's going to have to tell me, don't make us wait, woman. <laughs> uh, somebody's going to have to tell me if the sound is okay. Hey, where's Wild Bill? It's fine. It's fine. Okay. <clears throat> okay, guys, I know you notice I'm wearing headphones. No reason for that. Not just because I'm listening to music. For the record, yes, I am listening to music, but that's, you know, not... Anyway, I'll explain it in a second. My comments weren't coming through. Oh, okay, awesome. You're still here. I mean, you're here. Okay, guys, there is a reason I'm wearing headphones today. <clears throat> and this is something I've never told anyone. And I mean no one. Music is therapy. Yes, yes, it is. And right now it's keeping me from losing my ever-loving mind or at least what's left of it. Because what I have never told anyone is that, um, okay, you ready? Brace yourselves. Confession. Great. And it just went out of sync again. I guarantee it. Anyway, um, it's not a huge confession, but being that I am a live streamer and I have people on screen with me, London, <clears throat> uh, it can affect me because 
if you're typing a message, I can read it just fine. But if you're on screen with me and you're speaking, I might not hear you. The cause needs to move out. <laughs> well, that's a different problem, but yes. Um, sometimes I will ask you to repeat yourself because I didn't catch what you said. And please let me say, I'm so sorry that I do that to you guys, especially you guys that are on screen with me. Uh, but because I have a hearing issue, it makes things a little difficult for me and it makes it really, really irritating <clears throat> for the people that's talking to me because they continually have to repeat themselves. Now, what's wrong with my hearing is not actual hearing loss, not in the normal sense. And you just saw an effect of it. Um, it's, it's a noise. Half a century of <laughs> making you lose your hearing. <laughs> yes, yes, it is. We'll blame it on that. Yes, it's totally that. Okay, well, thank you, Alvin, <laughs> because most people get really irritated when I go, what? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that, because I know how irritating it can be, because I've had to repeat myself for people, and with me having to do that, too, you would think I would be more understanding. Um, Guys, I swear to God, I'm going to throw it. Uh, it's because right now it's worse than it's ever been. As weird as this may sound, uh, with my sinuses and allergies flared up, it makes the noise worse. And by noise, I mean I have noise in both of my ears. And it's not just what I'm listening to. <laughs> okay, if I am like this, um, I hear it constantly. Uh, the noise can be different things. Father has tinnitus. noise in his ears uh mine changes it can go from a really really high pitch noise in one ear uh to other than a oh, wait i don't know it's kind of it's tinnitus but it's enhanced when my sinuses are flared up and right now it's so loud that i'm trying to watch the volume of my voice so that i'm not screaming for people to hear me because i can't hear me Ringing in his ears. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> it can, the current moment, it sounds like a bunch of crickets all at one time. And it's really loud right now because my sinuses are flared up. And that's why I wanted to tell you guys because it's really hard for me to hear right now. So if we're in a stream and you're on screen with me and I, I can't hear you, it, it's not because of you. It's because of the noise in my ears. Which is why I had the headphones on. Because uh, drowning out the sound, so to speak, putting something in your ear like music or white noise or the sound of rain uh, helps you to not focus on the noise and you're focused on something else so it doesn't bother you as much so if you see me start a stream like this 
it's because I'm trying to get my mind off of the noise. I'm trying to focus on something else. So I've got music in my ears. Um, or something just because I'm wearing headphones doesn't mean it's music. It could be white noise. It could be rain. It's a sound. As long as I've got a sound there for my mind to focus on, <clears throat> it helps me to not concentrate on the noise, not think about the noise. Constant ringing in her ears. Never quite understand what she meant because I did not. That's good, Alvin, that you don't experience it because it's irritating as shit. But I figured since I'm scheduled to stream tonight, I should probably let you guys know. Because there is a real good chance that I'm going to ask somebody on screen with me to repeat what they just said. Because it's really loud right now. And it's due to the fact that my sinuses and allergies are flared up really bad because of what time of year it is. And everything is blooming and pollen, literally. Pollen, you can see it blowing through the air here in the area where I live. So, um, sorry if I have to ask you to repeat yourself. I promise if I didn't have to, I wouldn't. <laughs> I just, I can't hear real good right now. <clears throat> and I know anybody that was in the stream last night probably remembers. Okay, I don't know if you even heard that because my screen just went black. I asked my son last night when he came through, I said, do you hear crickets? Because where we live, crickets do come in sometimes. Thank you, guys. And me being crazy as a shithouse rat. That doesn't help. Deaf in one ear. Oh, I didn't know that, Robert. Huh. Learn something new every day. Okay, second confession. I wasn't planning this, but I'm going to go ahead and do it. And I'm going to try to do it before my son comes through here. Yesterday, when I lost my mind, or at least what was left of it, when I shut my Facebook down. <clears throat> It's because I reach a point of frustration. <clears throat> and I'm sure anybody that's ever dealt with depression, to you, if not all of you, have reached this point before where you give up. You get tired of fighting and you just give up. And you feel. Calls me, oh man. Confess, I felt like one yesterday after work. I would say you did. That's the first 12 hour you've done in, well, I would say years probably. You feel completely worthless. Like, I reach a point where I thought it is not worth, I am not worth being friends with. Because there's too much stress and there's too much drama involved with being my friend. It's, it's due to my son. I've been there, yeah. Um, my son doesn't like my friends. And this is probably going to sound like a teenager, and I don't mean it to come off that way. It's just for 50 years that I've been on this earth, I've had to fight. Uh, first with my parents. Because I couldn't be myself. And I wasn't an outrageous kid or a teenager. I, I didn't want everything in the world. I didn't feel misunderstood. I just, my family never liked any of my friends. 
So I, it was almost like I couldn't have any. And then when I got married, uh, for 20 years of marriage, I felt the same way. I couldn't be myself. I couldn't have friends because my husband never liked any of my friends. And don't get me wrong. I know everybody has a, a friend that's irritating as shit to everybody, but it's not that. It's, he never liked any of my friends. He was never accepting of, might have to do with him. Yeah. Um, so I felt like I couldn't have friends. I couldn't do things. I couldn't talk to people because he got jealous, uh, because he didn't like the people I was talking to. Uh, and once we divorced, I felt like I was finally free to be myself. And I became who I was meant to be. And that person is the person you see. But then my son started doing this thing where he doesn't like my friends. He doesn't want my friends walking in the house. You guys know uh, my two closest friends. They live right next door. And we've always had this open door policy where we don't knock on each other's doors. If we want each other for something, we just walk into each other's apartment without knocking. And my son can't stand it. He's a grown man, okay? He's 26, so he's an adult. But what you don't know and what you can't say anything to him about is this. My son has emotional issues. And he breaks down. And he takes that from me. I know that. So I try to be understanding and I try to deal with it. But what happened that set me off, that caused me to break, <clears throat> was the other night, I stepped over at Jennifer's for something, and she had just got home. And she asked me if I had any Tylenol. And I said, yeah, I've got Tylenol. Come on, I'll get it for you. And she looked at me. Uh, I'm good where I'm at. The look on her face, the look in her eyes crushed me. Because I thought, oh my God, my own friends are not even comfortable walking into my house anymore. Because they can't deal with him. He's not comfortable with them coming in, but now they're not comfortable coming in. And I thought I was losing my friends. I thought I had lost my friend, my best friend. And it was in that moment that I thought, I'm done. I can't keep doing this. I can't fight anymore. I can't. It's not worth it. I'm not worth it. I'm not worth being friends with because there's too much stress and too much drama. Uh, shit. I swear to God, I'm going to throw this computer. Um, the other one should be in tomorrow. But he That's what I'm
Okay, come on. Unmute. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> So that's why I did what I did yesterday. I can't ask him not to be his self. Okay. I cannot ask my son not to be his self. I understand he has emotional issues because I've been there. I've been where he's at. I've dealt with it. I've moved past it. But he's not there yet. I can't hardly hear you. Can you hear me better now? Son of a bitch. Damn it. That's the wrong button. <clears throat> okay, I swear to God, I'm going to throw something and break it. Is anyone else having trouble hearing me? Sound better now? Okay. I can hear you now. Not anymore. Okay, I just have to switch the setting and then switch it back. Sound good, but sometimes there is a clicking noise. Okay, I think that's a microphone, maybe. I don't talk about the problems with my son a lot because that's his personal business and I don't like to put it out into the world. And if he knew I said something to you guys, he would be pissed. I felt that way too, Trish, when I lived in New York. All those friends. Yeah.
Uh, yeah, me too. All those years. Yeah. You know, honestly, I think there's a reason that we're together. And I mean all of us here in this stream right now. And even the ones that uh, aren't in the stream, the ones, the regulars. I think God brought us together to lean on each other. Because we all understand, because we've all been there. Never like my friends, but one, yeah. Elsa and Robert are being awfully quiet. Okay, so she was really jealous. That's never good. The crazy ones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Run like hell. That's right. Okay, guys, I'm going to go. I just wanted to let you guys know about my hearing issues. Uh, hopefully it will have calmed down some by tonight. But if you see me start the stream wearing headphones, you'll know. Yep, still loud.
But I will see you guys tonight here on Robert's channel. Uh, Robert, hope you don't mind that I used your channel <laughs> for my little confession. My father came into the room, started talking, and I had to turn the volume down. That's okay. Uh, you can always back up and watch it. Premiere tonight at 7. Right. Don't forget, guys. Uh, Wild Bill's got a premiere tonight at 7. Oh, God. Uh, Wild Bill, which channel is that on? That's your Rebel channel, right? All good. Good deal. <laughs> I want to make sure everybody knows the right channel. Media channel, right. Ah, oh, how could I forget that? Media and the Arts podcast channel. So don't forget, Wild Bill's um, premiere is tonight at 7 on the uh, Media and Arts podcast channel channel uh which there should be a link to down in the description but i will see you guys tonight around eight ish <laughs> okay but i think that is going to do it for me for now this is ice pets queen co-leader of the posse and beth's sister stay horny my friends and i am tripping out <laughs>